Hello Diamond Droppers, Kelowna Giuliano here and today I wanted to talk to you guys about something that I feel is really important in um, life business balance and that's meditation and meditation I will just say is something that I totally struggle with. It is the hardest thing for me to find the time to sit down and be still and I have been doing meditation on and off since I was about 19 and I've taken lots of courses and learned uh, different types of meditation I have taught meditation and still it's it's really difficult for me to do but I find that the more I talk about it and teach about it um, then I kind of have to do it myself so it keeps me on track there's definitely been times in my life when I don't do it for days or weeks or even months and I notice a huge shift when I add meditation back into my life so I don't know how many of you meditate regularly or have ever meditated before but I just wanted to talk about it a little bit because before I knew what meditation was I just kind of thought it was this woo woo thing and I, I didn't really I thought it was kind of weird um, but there's a lot of science behind it and if you've ever uh, read any of Deepak Chopra's books he does a wonderful job of talking about spirituality blended with science and there are lots of scientific studies that show that meditation and breath work um, actually have a profound effect on our physiology so um, people with high blood pressure um, people with um, chronic illnesses they even have done studies um, in one of Deepak Chopra's books about how meditation is actually anti-aging so they followed a group of um, regular meditators people who meditated 20 to 30 minutes a day I think um, or maybe even twice a day they followed them for like five years and ten years and then they followed a group of people that did not meditate and the people who meditated consistently um, showed lower um, levels of all different signs of aging so you'd have to I have to go back to the book to find the exact details but they actually had um, a lower chronological age um, as far as their physiology their skin uh, all these different factors so when I read stuff like that um, it reminds me how important meditation is another thing I love about it is it's free you don't have to like go buy anything or um, you just sit down and do it and most people myself included always the excuse is I don't have time but I guarantee you have five minutes that could turn into ten minutes that could turn into twenty minutes and if it was going to transform your business and your personal life you would probably you probably do it right um, so let's do a little bit of meditation shall we so I like to start a meditation with a, two things an essential oil and an intention so an intention is making a wish it's what you want to have happen that day um, what you want to have happen maybe your next rank um, maybe you want to have more peace or more love it can be something general or it can be something very specific and so I like to pair meditation essential oils um, you know and intention so I have abundance oil today you guys can grab whatever oil you want um, and I'm just gonna do what we do drop of oil I do three clockwise circles and then close your eyes and start to take some deep breaths of the oil that you chose so you're taking that oil into all of your cells and just starting to pay attention to your breath so just inhale deeply through your nose and start to expand your belly if you want to apply that oil somewhere on your body you can and then just go ahead and allow your hands to rest in your lap face up or face down on your knees you're just in a comfortable seated position either in a chair or on the floor with your spine straight and coming back to your breath 
inhaling through the nose and expanding your belly. So just letting your belly go. And then exhaling through the mouth. And really sigh your breath out. You can even make a snoring sound in the back of your throat. That signals the brain and the body to relax. And let's take one more nice deep breath into the belly. And then bringing your hands into a prayer position over your heart center and setting an intention for this quiet time, this break, this meditation. So your intention could be one word, it could be a sentence, it could be a thought, whatever it is that you're working on right now related to your business or even your personal life. And once you've set your intention, just let go of it, knowing that it's been heard by the universe or God or whatever you believe in. Allowing your hands to rest in your lap. And all meditation is, is bringing your awareness back to your breath. You're never going to make all of your thoughts completely disappear. But what we're searching for is that little gap between the thoughts and just starting to expand that gap. So every time your mind starts to wander, just bring your awareness back to the sensation of the air flowing in and out through your nose. I'll keep track of the time. Just allow yourself to be in this present moment. Nowhere to go, nothing to do. Bringing your awareness back to your breath, not changing it, just using it as a tool to stay present. And then bringing your awareness back to the intention that you set and bringing your hands back to that prayer position over your heart center. And just acknowledge yourself for taking that little time out today and setting your intention and paying attention to your breath. And whenever you feel ready, you can open your eyes. Welcome back. And just know that taking that little break helped calm your mind. Meditation and breath work helps with anxiety. It helps with our immune system. It helps keep our skin healthy. And I promise that if you adopt a regular meditation practice, you will notice some huge changes in not only your personal development, but also that translates over to your business. So when we tap into that universal energy or God or source or whatever you wanna call it, um, it's infinite. And you start to realize that we could pull in energy that we don't have inside of us, but we're connected with. And once you tap into that, you can do anything, you can be anything, um, and you start to let go of some of those blocks that are holding you back. So I hope that's helpful for you guys, and I hope that um, all of you flourish in your business. So have a great day, bye.